Welcome everybody to Mario Kart Wii Wi-Fi Races. This is the grand finale, and I am your host, Anthony. Oh, that old school intro. Uh, so I guess I might as well just go ahead and address the elephant in the video. And that would be that, you know, ever since part 50, I said I'm not going to do any new videos of Mario Kart Wii. You know, I did do those uh, re-commentaries of the first battles. I did the uh, re-commentary of part 31 with the ABTZ guys. But still, you know, this is kind of like a momentous time in Mario Kart Wii history. This is the end of Mario Kart Wii. So I figured I might as well just do one more video in the... Same old standard three race format, because uh, I've been I've been requested to do it many 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 times over the years, and uh, you know why not? You know the servers are going offline once and for all, and I might as well just get that one last video in and tickle everybody's nostalgia. That that is a phrase that I literally just came up with. Alright, so we're going to be starting off this video with GCN Mario Circuit. It's a good one. Eh, actually, I'll just say a decent one. You know, I actually prefer the Wii version of Mario Circuit to this. But, uh, you know, th this, is, uh, this is also equally acceptable. Alright, so right off the bat, you're uh, pretty much noticing that... Uh, <laughs> almost in last place. I'm going to go ahead and hold on to that bullet bill for uh, whatever reason. Just use it randomly, you know, maybe I'll just knock out some people. Uh, I'm not sure I... No, I did not hit that Rosalina. Now, this Rosalina is actually uh, the... Hands down, the best player in this specific room. Uh, this Rosalina was ridiculously good. Uh, I didn't quite catch his name, but, uh, you know, it was there in the... Uh, when everybody was loading and whatnot. Oh, there goes a blue shell. Um, so, yeah, basically for this video, I uh, did three completely, di completely different rooms. Um, and so, uh, I, just, I might as well just throw that out there now, you know, just, just to get it out of the way. Uh, you know, so for the next race, uh, you know, you're gonna see all completely different people. No, uh, no crazy pro Rosalinas here. Yeah, like, I tried to, because I saw this person play, you know, just before this match. And I was like, wow, this person's really good, you know, I should probably focus on them. You know, maybe take them out, but, uh, you know, this is Mario Kart Wii, this is not like an FPS here, you can't just, like really target somebody and stop them from getting first. It's really not that easy. Um, so yeah, now, once again, this Rosalina is way, way out in first, and I'm way, way back in fifth. Third? Fourth. Alright. Make, make up my mind, please. So as you can probably tell, my, uh, my skills on this game are uh, pretty rusty as compared to the days when I first uh, was well, doing this video series. Uh, wow, that was great. Oh, I like how that passed off to me some, somehow. Maybe, maybe maybe this guy can take it back. Maybe. Um, but yeah, part of that reason is because I now, unfortunately, you know, I'm playing it on the Wii U. I migrated all of my info to the Wii U from the Wii. And uh, unfortunately, I can't use the GameCube control anymore, which was my main controller setup. <laughs> Look at him. Look at my me. I miss that guy. He's still there, though. You know, he's on my Wii U. So already failing. Already losing some points right off the bat from the first race. Alright, so the next race might not have 11 players, because the next race is going to have completely new people, as I mentioned before. So, like I said, I can't really use my GameCube controller. I'm gonna have to be using the Wii Remote and Nunchuck, which I find... I don't know, I, I just find it really awkward to play with. I, I just... I can't get it down that well. You know, you saw me on the first lap of GCN Mario Circuit over the little hills towards the end of the track, and I just kind of like stunted like straight into the fence. Yeah, it's just, I'm not, I'm not very proficient with that controller setup. All right, so now we got a couple of uh, Japanese people, or was three, perhaps? I couldn't tell how many there were. Japinzi! That, that's, that's a thing now with me. Um, but yeah, as you can tell, I'm voting for Luigi Circuit over and over and over again. I don't know, I just, you know, just for the, uh, the, the nostalgia factor. And also, you know, if I was a little bit better with the Wii Remote Nunchuck, I would have voted for Rainbow Road, j just because of, like, the more nostalgia. But, um, you know, I figured Luigi Circuit was, was, uh, more better because, uh, you know, item insanity. 
Oh, no, not quite this time. What are we doing? Oh, great. Oh, yeah, that's right. I remember that. I remember looking at, like, you know, Luigi Circuit and Mario Circuit and uh, Coconut Mall, and I was like, oh, you know, all of those, all of those tracks sound fine, actually. And then, of course, it has to be DS Time Man Hills. If anybody doesn't remember that little inside joke, uh, Time Man, which is one of the dudes from ABDZ Comms, Time Man 291486, um, he hated this track. And uh, the rest of us pretty much uh, kind of poked fun at him. Oh, that's good. And uh, basically, we would just, you know, poke fun at him and say, Oh, this is Time Man's favorite track! Ah! Anyway. Uh, so, being the uh, cheeky little jerk that I am, I recently asked a question on uh, Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. Uh, basically asking people to ask me questions for my impending Mario Kart 8 series. And uh, I decided to, well, the cheeky part of that is that I actually wanted to use uh, a, a few of those questions for this specific video, because it wouldn't be a Mario Kart Wii Wi-Fi Races video without questions, now would it? So, first off, we have Two and a Half Stooges on Twitter asking, playing with Mui, where did you expect to be now, back when you were doing your Mario Kart Wii series? Uh, that's actually a good question, I like that one. Um, really, what was it, 2009, the end of 2009? I, I really had no idea what I was going to be doing in 2014. Uh, I think, I think at the time I was more, more focused on 2012, and, uh, you know, worried about, <laughs> is that year actually going to be the end of the world? So, uh, you know, everybody was thinking that. Luckily it was not, and, uh, of course, uh, luckily we could move on from, uh, 2012, and I could, uh, of course, get one more Mario Kart Wii video out. Oof, lucky. Very lucky. Alright, so, uh, you know, I really don't know. I, 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 I want to say something like, you know, really, you know, cocky, like, oh man, I expected myself to be a super YouTube celebrity by this point, with, you know, a billion subscribers. Oh, this is good. Blue Shell literally right at the end. Hopefully I don't just get screwed over. Oh, the Bowser slipped before got hit by something, and perfect. <sighs> Finally getting first. So you're going to notice pretty quickly, uh, once this race ends, that uh, I actually have less VR than what I did at the end of the last race. Well, that's because there were, like, a number of races in between. Um, you know, I just didn't think they were very good uh, or very interesting. And uh, certainly I didn't come in first place, so, you know, I figured, hey, this DS Desert Hills uh, affords me the opportunity to talk about time in, as well as, uh, you know, get in first place. All right. So, uh, I'm gonna jump over to another question, and if I could actually find one, if my eyes could perhaps focus. Uh, Josh Coffee on Facebook asks, How did you celebrate the lack of Funky Jerk Kong in Mario Kart 8, of course? Uh, you know, I think I, uh, got up, I did a little dance, you know, all over the place. Uh, I was pretty happy about that, uh, you know, to be rid of Funky Gangster Kong. And uh, his crazy, crazy voice, and all those weird little noises that he makes, like when he does stunts and, and stuff. He, he makes all sorts of, all manner of weird noises. I don't think, he, I don't even think he's saying anything. He's just making noises. Uh, but yeah, it, it looks like perhaps. Oh, Luigi Circuit, we get our item insanity. Uh, it looks like they are in fact bringing back the uh, the character stats thing. And from what I understand, right, you know, at this point, before the game's even out yet, uh, it appears as though Wario may actually end up being the new Funky Kong. Which is unfortunate. I seriously just wanted the character stats to go away forever, because I wanted to just literally play as, you know, like anybody I wanted, rather than feeling like, Oh, well, you know, uh, Wario's so much faster than everybody else, so I might as well play as him if I want to win. I just, I find that really, really silly. But, uh, you know, there's a heck of a lot more customizability in this game as compared to Mario Kart Wii, so perhaps it might actually end up being a non-factor. So, what was that? I think I started off in third, into the second lap, and I'm back in third. Huh. Wow. Okay. Thanks for that green shell. You know, there really needed to be, like, some sort of alert that other items were perhaps coming up on you, like, a, you know, a green shell or a ba bomb you know. Maybe somebody's throwing a banana peel at you. I like how they always just do that Donkey Kong Jr. and Super Mario Kart 
Like, you would always see it on the bottom screen. It's like, oh my god, he's throwing up an in at you. Boom. <laughs> Better him than me. Oh my. Oh my gosh. And once again, I'm back in third. I just can't. Oh, no, never mind. Oh, oh. Wow. Okay. That was interesting. Making use of that boost. Oh my god. Reminds me of the very first Mario Party Wi-Fi races. Out of the way, fatty! This is a this is a real nail biter here. This is this is why it's item insanity. That was actual item insanity right there. Just shells everywhere, blue shell, lightning bolt. What? Oh, this is not good. If I get hit by something, I'm not gonna have any protection from it. Item box right around the last corner and past the finish line. Gut first. Oh my god, that guy got hit by a blue shell. <laughs> Such good timing. God first on the track that I really, really wanted to play. What a great way to go out! So that's it. That is officially it. I'm never going to be doing any more Mario Kart Wii races or videos or whatever, unfortunately. Um, so I really hope that you all enjoyed this and of course, uh, if you like this video, why don't you subscri subscribe or check out some of my other videos. There's more in the ways to stay tuned. And uh, don't forget to give it a like, share it, you know, all that fancy stuff. And uh, go ahead and ask me questions now, you know, like I said, preemptively, so that we can be ready. And, uh, well, until then, see you on Mario Kart 8.